if you've seen my channel before and you're wondering do, uh, is Sarah looking a little bit different yes I am um, firstly I've lost a stone yes, I've lost a stone hallelujah I'm still got a long way to go but I have lost that stone um, so that's the first thing and the second thing is I've had my lips done um, and you know what I was thinking to myself they don't look like they've been done but now that I've got lipstick on um, and I've done sort of my face I can definitely tell that they look bigger but I am due to have a top up in a couple of weeks time and I will be filming the whole process um, so you will see everything that happens and um, so if you're interested in that let me know in the comments down below also um, hit the subscribe button and turn your notification bell on that way when that video is uploaded you're going to be notified so that you don't miss it um, so yeah that is I think everything I wanted to cover before I've even started my intro <laughs> so today's look I did this beautiful green eye look oh I'm in love, I actually love it. Um, using the Huda Beauty Emerald Obsession Palette. So it has got a mirror here and it has got um, nine shades in it. Um, you do have a couple of mattes, but they're mostly shimmers and they're absolutely beautiful. So if you wanna see how I created this look using this palette, just keep on watching. Okay, so I just went ahead and done this eye off camera just so I could get my bearings and see where I wanted to go with it. So now I'm going to show you how I did it on this eye. So first of all, I took my P. Louise base in the shade 0.5. So this is the lightest shade I believe that they do. my channel for you know I always go under the eye to get quite dark circles there so the first shade I took was this one here it's the lightest shade um, and it's almost like a pastel in case you're wondering I'm just using a Zoeva 228 Luxe crease brush So the next shade I'm taking is this one here. It is the matte shade and it is quite a dark but yet vibrant green. Oh, I can hear a delivery driver outside. Hopefully that's my new washing basket. I know what you're thinking. She's too cool. Isn't it funny how when you get older, you get so excited about things that when you were younger you thought what <laughs> like how much suction your hoover has or <laughs> or that i'm getting a new wash bin that has three compartments for lights darks and colors oh i know i know it's too much but this is what happens when you get older i'm 32 now a mother what happens? You get excited about silly things like this. So the next shade I'm taking is this one here and it is a very dark shimmer and I'm just going to pop that here just to darken that up a little bit. So the next shade up I took was this one here and I'll show you. So creamy, such a beautiful shade. So I'm just gonna wet my brush. This is the 237 Detail Shader Zoeva. So I'll just give this a spritz. I'll just start packing that on. Okay, so then I went in with this shade here and it's like a greeny gold and I just put that in the inner corners. OK, 
Okay, now it's time to do the underneath and I'm just gonna sort of mirror what I've done on top, on the bottom lash line. So I have got a bit of fallout, but you know what, I'm okay with that, it's not a big deal. I just get a little baby wipe, give that a wipe and that is good to go. So this is the highlighter by Ofra and it is in the shade Glazed Donut. This is the one that they did a collaboration with with Nikki Tutorials, I absolutely love it. And that is just on my brow bone. Okay, so I'm not gonna apply any eyeliner today. I'm just gonna do some mascara and apply my falsies and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, so I put my eyelashes on. I also went ahead and did my face because today's video is all about the eye makeup. I didn't wanna focus on the face as well. Um, so I went ahead and did it. If you can tell that I've got, um, my foundation looks a bit strange, it's because I'm actually doing a test on um, two different foundations. So that is a video that will be coming up shortly if it's not already out. So it is gonna be the NARS Radiant Wear versus the Esther Lorde Double Wear. Um, but that will be out soon, if not already. So check that video out. Um, but yeah, this is completely done. I'm so happy with the way the eyes turned out. I think they're stunning. I would easily wear this look out um, for a night out. I think it's, it's really beautiful. I'm very drawn to the color green anyway. Um, but yeah, I, I just really, really enjoyed doing this makeup. Right, that is this video complete. Thank you so much for sticking with me. If you haven't already, please do hit the subscribe button, turn your notification bell on, and I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. I hope my hair doesn't look like a bird's nest. I spent ages doing it, trying to get nice big bouncy curls and they seem to have just dropped out, but that is another story. When smiles above, I just need one.